Welcome everyone to the play-in tournament as the ninth and 10th seeds of the Eastern Conference battle for a chance at the NBA playoffs. And on tap tonight, it's the Cleveland Cavaliers going up against the Boston Celtics. I'm Kevin Harlan with Mike Fratello and Clark Kellogg. On the sideline, David Aldridge. Masterpiece that's been painted out on the court. The Celtics on offense. Here's Woodson. Got it. Good job on the whole post. Woodson. Boy, there's something about knocking down that first bucket of the game that just adds to your adrenaline rush. Seeing the ball go through the net, it's just so nice. Here's Floyd. Pass to Sober. to the wing. Outside Irving. Five on the clock. Fires. High post. And good. Oh, 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 the right oh, the rim. So many different ways he can attack. He can pull up from the mid-range like he does here. The doctor is in the house, folks. Crew passes to Hubbard. Lane Beer with it. Walton defending. Great D that time from Walton. To the middle. Here's Sobers. That one's in his first shot this game. Oh, how about the confidence? I love watching him be that assertive down low. And pin the blame on the defense there. You can't just give him an open layup. Here's Drew. Last game he had 13. Lambeer passes to Woodson. And there's the drive. Good. And it's Lambeer with the assist that time. Woodson's got his second bucket of the night. Cavaliers have gone two or three here to start off the game. Here's Foy. He's been a factor in their offense on most nights with his scoring average of nearly 16 points a game. Pass to Walton. Down to five on the shot clock. Here's Irving. Again, the Cavaliers score. Good one from mid range. I like seeing him look to score from there. Through. They've been leaning on him for a decent chunk of their offense. He's averaging over 15 points a game. Basket counts. A red hot beginning to this game. Well, he's a real good offensive player, so they want to get him going early. So it's the Cavaliers now following the bucket by the Celtics. Here's Floyd, and he drops in the layup off the glass. He could have walked to the basket. First quarter of basketball, just over two and a half minutes played. Here's Drew. High post Lambeer. Pass to Woodson. Back to Lambeer. Just four to shoot. And yes, it's good. And Lambeer, clearly a high IQ offensive player. He realizes when that mid-range jumper is the best shot for him to take. Floyd passes to Sober. Screen by Walton. Irving from 15 feet away. Again, the Cavaliers score. So much of Irving's game is motion, but he can also simply catch and fire. Here's Drew. No scoring in this one. Collins pass it to Woodson. And again, it's Boston converted. With him, the scouting report says you've got to go over the screen. Absolutely. He'll hurt you from deep. So you have to fight through those picks. Here's Floyd. This game we saw him score 14. Stolen. And he drives in. Fades. And it's Boston with another. Cavaliers have gone five of six so far from the field to start out the game. Right 
outside Irving. And again, it's Cleveland. One of the things we got to admire and respect about him was his aggressiveness at the offensive end, always in attack mode. Time call here. The Celtics decide to talk it over. I think it's pretty clear Coach wants to change some things. How easy is that to do in a huddle? If you have an experienced team, that really helps. Drew. Here's Hubbard. He's covered by Irving. And here's Lambeer. Here's Woodson. And good as it just snugs right down through the net. We talk so much about the defense of Lambeer. You can forget. For a big, he's a real good passer. Now, here's Walton. And Irving throws it down. Dunking, no problem for him. Uh-uh. A high riser for sure. And he looks a stop it. Drew passes to Lambier. That's it. He's got two made now, and he's shooting two for three. You better hammer Lambier if you want to stop him. Here's Sobers. Last time out, he had 14 points. Floyd passes to Silver. Here's Jones. That one's in his first shot this game. Jones knows what he's doing inside. So polished in there. The efficiency epitomized. Here's Drew. Again, the Celtics good for two. I'll tell you what, both teams have got it going on. I mean, playing phenomenally well. Yeah, but I think it's going to be hard to keep this pace up. We'll see. Here's Floyd. Elbow shot. Again, the Cavaliers score. He'll hit those if you leave that much room. You need to do a better job of closing out. Here's Drew. Pass to Woodson. Cowan's now top the key. Wide open, couldn't capitalize. He thought that one was going down as soon as it left his hands. Well, with good reason. That was a great look. Just bad luck that they go down. Getting enough shots in close to play inside out. Boston trailer. Here's Drew. And here's Lambeer. Walton defending. against Lambeer. He had dropped for his third basket. He's missed only one shot. Relentless in his approach. Lambeer comes at you every minute he's on the floor. Going inside. Jones, the pass to Irving. And that comes off the assist by Jones. Irving's got 12 in the game. Hey, this is a rinse and repeat just like last game. He's had his fingerprints all over this one. Looking totally dominant. He realizes his strengths on offense and does a fantastic job playing to them and finding ways to stay on. Here's Woodson. He's got 10. Jones seizing his moment and taking the shot. Just going for it. Woodson's got all six of his shots to drop. Perfect from the floor. Pass to Jones. Here's Irving. Again, the Cavaliers score. And this game comes so easily to Irving. Fills it up in a multitude of ways. Here's Drew. Into the lane. Here's Woodson.
Robinson. Lambira screen. A second chance effort. And that one's good. Woodson. Woodson's got the game tied up here for the Celtics. And it's the Cavaliers with the ball. Right side Irving. Rebounded by the Celtics. Got the look he wanted. Sometimes it just doesn't go down. Here's Hubbard. Off to a good start as he gets his first shot attempt. Pretty easy around the cup. He'll convert that most every time. Here's Floyd. Screened by Walton. Drives to the hoop. Gets to the rim for two with the D all over him. Some contact just isn't enough against Walton. You gotta do more to shut down a gifted interior scorer like him. Here's Drew. Pass to Woodson. Outside, Lambeer. Five to shoot. Here's Drew. And Walton sends it back. What a play by Walton. A difference maker on the defensive end. Let's go. And that one's good, Irving. Irving's got 16 points. I like the way he's done a good job working that ball around tonight, getting it moving, wanting to get other guys going. This demonstrates leadership on his end, willing to give it up in an effort to make his guys better. And that one's good. Woodson, 16 points for him. He's been a reliable offensive option, currently maintaining an impressive field goal percentage in this game. Here he goes. Floyd, he sinks the 11-footer. So it's Boston now, trailing by two. Drew passes to Hunter. Here's Woodson. He's got 16 from about 19 feet. And it falls over the rim and in. There's a minute 40 left to play here in the first. Timeout call. Timeout, timeout. Floyd. He has six. Missed the shot. He's three for four in the game. And it's the Celtics ball. Inside. Here's Hubbard. The shot's good. Brown making the play. Hubbard's got his second basket of the night. Took the smaller defender to task inside. Great recognition of the mismatch. Here's Sobers. And it's good. Four left in the first quarter of the game. Brown outside. Pass to Woodson. Nice ball movement by Boston. A nice shot by Brown. Seems like Brown is always ready to go. The second he has the ball, he's forming his shot. Here's Foy. Let's it go. Plenty of room to knock down the shot. Boyd's got it all tied up now for the Cavs. Brown deciding where to go with it. There's 25 seconds left in the first quarter. Releases from 15. That one drops for him. And the Celtics lead by two. Such an accomplished scorer. Brown is a master at taking what the defense gives up. Here's Sobers. And he can be counted on to put some points on the board every night. He's averaging right around 13 and a half points a game. And the shot is good. Sobers has got his third bucket of the night. 
It's a tie game here in Cleveland. And the second quarter will be on the way when we come back. second quarter of this critical play-in game. What stands out to you from the Cavaliers in this one? You know, this is a team that has always looked to push it on the break whenever they can. A very opportunistic approach on offense. I like how aggressive they remain attacking in transition. The Cavaliers trailing. Here's Sobers. his fourth basket of the game and he's only taken four shots to a good start. Let's credit their discipline. They've been working for high percentage shots. Now here's Brown. Brown with the screen on Johnson. Here's Hubbard. And out of bounds. The Cavaliers will take it. Substitution on the court. Here's Sobers. And we're about a minute into the second quarter of play. Diving in. Oh, yes, he did. Five up and five down for him so far. That's too easy for him. You can see how comfortable he is inside. Here's Hubbard. Hasn't made one yet. A 19-foot shot. He hits the back iron and sinks the shot. I think he's got to show more fight than that. Can't give up on the play once you get screened. you got to continue to fight through. And Coach is definitely going to be frustrated with that effort. Or lack of one, that is. Here is Hawes. Here's Sobers. And it's rebounded by Nader. I'm sure he's upset right now. He had a space, had it all lined up, but just couldn't convert on the mid-range jumper. Back to Brown. Five on the clock. From 15 feet away, and he hits right. the jump shot. Brown's got the lead up to two now for Boston. Cavaliers have gone two or three from the field here to open the second quarter. Pass to Sober. It's good. Now he's shooting six for seven. Wonderful ball movement. Houston has a great feel for how to involve his teammates. We're just over two and a half minutes into the second quarter. Now Brown shot from free throw range. And he buries that one, drilling the rim on the way down. Brown's got six in the quarter. Excellent distribution. That possession highlighting how important unselfish this is. Here's Sobers. Gets it to go from 18 feet away. Sobers has got the game tied up here for Cleveland. Celtics have gotten four of the first five shots to fall in the second quarter. Standing shooter. Here's Hubbard. Came out, he had 14. Down to five on the shot clock. That one goes. Count it. Hubbard's got his second bucket of the game to go. All about the handles on that play to create some space. And uh, almost four minutes gone here in the second quarter of play. Off with the layup. To the paint. Here's Bernston, and he floats in for the easy two. Credit the assist on that one. That's the kind of look you're working towards. Nice play. Houston passes to Ainge. And here is Hawks. Cleveland moving it around. The kick out to Ainge. A 
pass to Hawks. His first attempt of the game finds the target. Good for about one per game. Ains finds his open man easily there. Up top, Brown. He's got 10. And off the left side of the rim, and it swirls in for him. Brown's got the lead back up to four now for the Celtics. Houston passes to Hawks. Counts it up top. Here's Ainge. Off to a good start as he hits his first shot attempt. What confidence off the catch. I like whenever Ainge goes right up with it. Here's Hubbard. He averages a bit over six points a game. A kick out to Brown. And too much time in the lane. They get called for the three-second violation. Austin Hill going to switch here. Substitution on the court. Cavaliers have gone six of eight from the field in the second quarter. Houston passes to Irving. Post good as the jump shot falls. Irving's got 18 points. The Celtics have gotten nearly everything to fall for them here in the second quarter. They're a great seven of eight from the floor. Hubbard the pass to O'Corn. Kicks it out to Collins. Here's Hubbard. Up top Brown. 12 points for him. And they pick up two. Here's Houston. Jones now it's off the key. Pass to Ainge. Now here is Irving. Again the Cavaliers score. And Irving understands his role in this squad, which is to score and to score often. So it's Boston now. Here's Hubbard. Unloads from 13. Again, the Celtics good for two. Here's Houston. And it's good off the back of the rim and in. Houston's got his first basket. Jeff Houston, so solid from the mid-range. I love to see him take a shot. Pass to O'Corn. And here's Brown. Shoots over Ainge. Again, the Celtics good for two. It's not surprising to see Brown fill it up. He's an explosive scorer who can hurt you on the drive, from distance, and everywhere in between. Timeout is called. First of the game for the Cavaliers.
come in off the loss to Washington. And it's time for an injury report. Hi, guys. The head athletic trainer for the Celtics provided some information to us. He told me that although he twisted the knee pretty badly, nothing looks like it's torn. This was a team that was struggling a bit, so losing him hurts extra. But they have to cope with the loss. Back to you. David, thanks for the report. And Mike, good to hear. He will not be out that long. Yeah, Kevin, that could have been a lot worse. Oof. Here's Brown. The Cavaliers making the shot. Pass to Woodson. The shot's good. Brown Woodson. making the play. Woodson's got 20 points. Wow. Relentless effort on the offensive end. The defense just can't contain his energy. To the inside. Here's Irving. An amazing finish with a hand right in his face. Irving's got six here in this quarter. Even when you contest Irving's shot, he's capable of burning you. This is how gifted a scorer he is. Drew passes to Woodson. Here's Brown. Nice spin off the left rim and in. Brown's got 18 points. This is what coach wants to see. Moving the ball to where the coverage is weakest. Pass to Jones. Here's Irving. Two points. That one goes. Irving's got it all tied up now for the Cavs. An incredible leaper. Dr. J owns the painted area. Brown outside. Lambeer with a screen on him. Took the opportunity when he saw it. He's got 20. He's been a big factor here in the first half. Scoring in bunches. Floyd passes to Ainge. Shoots over Brown. And a big bounce off the rim, but it sinks right in. Ainge has got a second bucket tonight. Really good work from the mid-range there. When the defense gives Ainge this shot, he'll take it. Here's Brown, and it's Boston with another. Here's Floyd. Ten points for him. Pass to Walton. And it's blocked. There's that tenacity that Lambier plays with. Phenomenal job coming up with the block. And that one's good. Woodson. Woodson's got four points in the quarter. Pick and roll really is about timing and execution. Well run. Shoots from the line. That one's in there. The Boston League has cut down to just two points in the bucket from Floyd. Love the energy on his drive. The defense didn't expect that coming from him. Brown outside. Wolverine. Again, the Celtics good for two. And when you're guarding him, you've got to fight over the top. Lock and trail around the screen and deny the perimeter shot. Outside Irving. A minute 42 left in the first half of the game. It's good. Irving's got 26 points. This is exactly the type of shot the coaching staff wanted. Terrific work. Here's Drew. To the wing on the left. Just five on the clock. The shot from 20 feet away. Good on the shot. Woodson. Woodson's got the lead up to four now for Boston. Here's Floyd. 12 points for him. There's 57 seconds left in the first half. That one goes in. Eight points for him. Say some ball movement there. When you pass the ball like that, good things happen. Here's Drew. Fires top of the key. Good. He hits the jump shot. Drew's got the lead back up to four now for the Celtics. And here are the Cavaliers now. Goes up from the top of the key. Again, the Cavaliers score. 29 seconds left in the first half of basketball. Here's Drew. 
He's got six to the left wing. Pass to Brown. Here's Woodson. Rebound. Bill Wolf. Now Irving. Here's Floyd. Good, and the assist goes to Irving. Floyd's got 16 points. It's a tough game here in Cleveland. We'll get right back to the action when we return. Hi, everyone. Glad to have you back for third quarter action of the play-in game. It's been a clinic from Dr. J, Julius Irving so far. Boy, you like the discipline and patience he's played with through the first half. Never forcing it, always letting the game come to him. Just good, sound, fundamental basketball. And welcome to the second half of this high-stakes play-in clash. And here's Brown. He'll bring it up for Boston. Under that one. Here's Sobers. Good once again. That makes an eight for nine this game. Working his way inside for a high percentage look there. Nicely done. A hey, bumpy start to a new half for this D, though. They kind of gave that up. Here's Drew. It's Brown on the wing. at the elbow and the shot goes in Brown's got the game tied up here for the Celtics second half rolling along now about a minute play here here's Sobers Walton a screen on Brown and he makes that one Sobers has got four points this quarter you know coaches will take possessions like that all day long phenomenal use of the screen Brown outside Line J on the way, and he gets it to go, hitting off the back of the rim. Brown's got 28 points for the game. And here are the Cavaliers. Just over a minute and a half played here in the third. No time away from contact there. Celtics have gone two of three from the field to start the second half. Pass to Woodson. Outside, Lambie. Tries it from 19. And there are the Celtics with another basket. He's having a really good night from the field. I know the defense is keying in on him. He's the marquee on the scouting report, but they need him involved if they're going to pull this out. Now here's Jones. Looking at his point production, he averages almost eight points a game. Coach Rotello, they've been effective on the offensive end in this one. Yeah, they've created good looks and made the most of them. Here's Drew. Pass to Collins. The Celtics working the ball around now. Six to shoot. They now take the lead. Lambeer's got eight. Don't sleep on the jumper of Lambeer. It's solid. He's put in a ton of work. Side Irving. Fades and shoots. The Celtics with the lead. Right around three minutes into the second half. Woodson passes to Drew. Here's Woodson. He's covered by Irving. Six on the shot clock. Brown with the bounce pass. Here's Woodson. And that's collected by Bill Walton. Walton's got lead on number five here tonight. Sobers. From out on the wing, he knocks it down. Sobers has got eight points in the quarter. You have to love the unselfishness on display there. Excellent pass. 
Brown outside. Good shot on the way, and he gets the jumper to drop. Brown's got 30 points. For Cleveland, they've gone three or four so far in the third quarter from the field. Pretty good start to the hand. Here's Irving. He claims that one off the back iron and down it falls. Ties it up with that one. You know he's such a smart scorer. Not forcing anything, letting the opportunities come to him. Drew passes the ball. Here's Woodson. Shots good. Brown making the play. Brown's got his fifth assist in this one. Freddie with great vision there. Easily found the open man. Here's Foy. He's got 16. And Dr. J slams it in. There's a Dr. J dunking ability at work. He is fantastic at finishing on alley -oops. Here's Drew. First team foul. Austin with the ball. Up top, Brown. Shot is good off the back rim and in. Brown's got 32 points. The basis of our game is the pass. Sherry, being a great teammate. Takes it inside. Floyd, good. And you talk about a total 180-degree turn from the first half. They look like a completely different team in the second. They've really upped their energy. Doing a great job pushing the ball right there. Here's Drew. Eight points for him. On the wing run. Big foul. First personal foul. Second team foul. Here's Drew. Nestle Beer. Just five to shoot. Here's Brown. Again, the Celtics good for two. And here are the Cavaliers now. Trailing by two. Floyd passes to Irving. Lays it up off the glass. Irving's got 34 points. When it's this close, every bucket matters. You need good looks. Brown outside. On the wing. Count that one. Brown's got 12 points here in the second half. Cavaliers have gotten nearly everything to drop this quarter. They're 7 of 8 from the floor since halftime. Floyd passes to Irving. Makes it off the glass. Irving's got 8 here in the quarter. Looking unfazed on the way up. Irving striking off the contact like a champ. Here's Drew. He's got 8. Woodson passes to Brown. And he gets the friendly spin in that one drops. Brown's got 38 points. You can tell that stroke has been perfectly crafted through hundreds of shots. Timeout called the Cavaliers. So it's the Cavaliers now. A two-point game. Houston passes to one. Here's Sobers. And to Walton. And the layup's good off the glass. Walton's got it all tied up now for the Cavs. With height, touch, basketball IQ, Bill Walton has it all to score down low. A 19-foot shot, and it's Boston with another. 
a tremendous team effort, Mike, offensively from them tonight. Well, they've been unselfish, a ton of assists, plus lots of different scorers out there. Yeah, things you all appreciate. Here's Drew. He's got eight. Fires from the wing. And it's rebounded by Cleveland. And he forced that shot. When the defense is this tight, you're better off passing out of it looking for a better shot. Here's Houston. And they get some nice contributions from him on a nightly basis as he averages over 11 points a game. Pocket four. Here's Sobers. And he could not get that one to go. Out of contact. And he'll go to the line for two. A different look now for Cleveland. Oz is checked in. And Danny Ainge is subbed in for four. Oz. Danny Ainge. Austin trailing. Here's Drew. And a kind roll that time off the rim as that one falls. Drew's got four points in the quarter. With him, the scouting report says you've got to go over the screen. Absolutely. He'll hurt you from deep. So you have to fight through those picks. Now, here's Walton. He's a good contributor to his team, averaging about 10 and a half points a game. Here's Drew. Down low. Here's O'Connor. And two free throws coming up. Unable to get that one to go with all the content. Well, that's what we call a good foul. Make them earn it at the line. Might not be pretty, but that's the right play in that situation. He saved the layup with that foul. Johnson, he's checked in for Jones. Here's Houston. to aim. Lock at six. No one near him. He squares up in six. Eames has got six. Perfect pass there. Understanding how to set up his teammate. And so Brown will bring it up for the Celtics. Here's O'Corn. Running by Hawks. It is good. He'll get a chance for one more at the line. I like the ball movement. An assisted basket. Credit to Brown for getting the dime. The Cavaliers trail by three. Here's Houston. And he uses the glass on the way. Houston's got his second basket of the night. Works his way in there. Houston with no fear. Here's Drew. Ten points for him. That shot, no good. Some solid defense from Johnson. Runs the pass to English. Here's Houston. High post shot. He can't get that one to fall. And there's a minute 45 left in the third quarter. Here's Houston. Holding up top. And here is Ainge. Cleveland needs to get a shot off here. And off the fire, and in it goes. Really nice job moving the ball around that time, picking apart that defense. Pass to Brown. Wide open shot is on the money. Brown's got 42 in the game. You can tell he scanned the whole floor and found the exact right guy to feed. 51 seconds left in the third quarter. Here's Houston. Count that one. Houston's got four points this quarter. He went on the attack, working his way into a nice shot. Up top, Brown. Ainge covering. Brown outside. Shoots over Ainge. 
and he wills that one in, sinking right through off the back iron. The Cavaliers trail by three. Seven second difference, shot and game clock. Houston passes to Ainge. Walton a screen on Brown. Ainge. Chop up two there. Ainge has got eight points. Relentless. Ainge is someone who constantly tests the defense. Brown outside. Here's Bernston. The shot's good. Brown making the play. Brown's got his seventh assist here tonight. And he finished the third quarter. It's still close. Both teams trading baskets. It's the Celtics leading by three. And we're coming right back after this break to get the fourth quarter underway. Celtics leading by three. Here's Hubbard. Pulls up from the corner. Pause with the rebound. Here's Houston. Pass to Hawes. Now here is Ainge. Oh, yes, he did. Five up and five down for him so far. The effort level you get from Ainge on offense is tremendous. He puts in the sweat to find his shots. Here's Hubbard. On the wing, Brown. And Cleveland making a change here. Austin's checked in. First team five. Now into the lineup for your Cavaliers. Number 25, Curtis Watson. Nader the pass to Fernston. Here's O'Corn, and he gets it to go from the high post. And the Celtics lead by three. And I gotta say, a defense has been non-existent tonight. They've been matadoring all game. It's a lack of effort, communication, and it's happening to both teams here late in the game. Now, here is Ainge. Shoots over Brown, and it falls over the rim and in. Ainge has got four points now in the quarter. Ainge beats you all around the floor. He's a three-level scorer for sure. About a minute and a half into the fourth quarter now. Here's Hubbard. Shot clock at five. Here's Brown. Cranes the 19-footer. Brown's got 46 points. Both offenses, I tell you, are cooking with gas right now. We've got a shootout on our hands. Look out. Game moves along. Two minutes gone here in the fourth. Ainge with the ball. Austin grabs the miss. O'Corn to the left side wing. And Brown now top the key. Great open look there. And now a five point Celtic lead. It's obvious he's looking to continue to attack on offense so this lead can expand. And if you were hitting like he is in this one, you would be too. His efficiency is the lot the shot's good from Washington. In a tight one like this, you have to trust in his ability. Yeah, I agree with you, Greg. I mean, he plays with no fear, and he certainly knows how to put the ball in the basket. Now, here's Brown. Over eight. Connects again. There's no question about it. They are feeding the right guy. He's been on fire all night. In a crucial moment, too. No one's come close to stopping him. 
Wilson right side. From down in the low post, it goes. Austin's got four points this quarter. Celtics leading by three. Brown outside. Shoots over Ainge. Another one goes. Incredible. How about the quarter from him? On a tear. Lawson outside. Pass to Hawn. Cavaliers moving the ball around. Here's Houston. Puts it up from 17. Again, the Cavaliers score. Celtics have gone 5 of 6 in the field to start the fourth quarter on a roll. And left to the wing. Here's Bernston. Plays it up and banks it in. And the Celtics lead by five. With the game and the balance, can't ask for a better look than that. Lawson. Awesome. And the D. Again, the Cavaliers score. Boy, got a pretty good look at it. And makes the most of it. Well, I put that one on the defense. It can't be leaving them open at this stage. Here's O'Corn. Hubbard. And he gets the kind bounce as that one drops in for him. Hubbard's got the lead up to five now for Boston. Here's Houston. A high post shot, and he hits the jump shot. Houston's got four points now in the fourth. Coming out of halftime, both of these teams have raised their intensity level. Yeah, the game's heating up, and the fans are going for sir. The Celtics call time. got some time to check in from the sidelines. You got for us, D.A.? Guys, during that last break, I listened to K.C. Jones address his team. He said to them, that's the kind of effort we need to bring every night. We're right in this thing. But it's going to take sustained effort to close it out. Now let's bring it home. Kevin, back to you. Thank you, David. Here's Woodson. To the inside, here's Drew. And it's Floyd with the rebound. The Cavaliers trail by three. There's the drive. And he gets the bucket. Floyd's got 22. That's on the defense. You can't let guys like him get this close inside. Here's Woodson. Pulled the shot a little up, but the bounce goes his way. 28 points for him. Cavaliers have gone on a tear here in the fourth. They're 8 of 9 on field goal attempts in the quarter. Here's Floyd. Screened by Walton. Floyd passes to Walton. Intercepted. Pass to Drew. Here's Woodson. Collins up top. Big one foul. Julius Irving. Second personal foul. Second team foul. Pass to Woodson. The Cavaliers pull it in. Sobers. Here's Floyd. Here's Sobers. Five to shoot. Here's Irving. 
And again, it's Cleveland. With the game of the he is ramping up his intensity. You can feel it. And that's exactly what Coach needs from him. A big offensive effort down the stretch. Here's Woodson. Outside, Lambeer. Pass to Woodson. At the elbow, Collins. And that one, good. And the Celtics lead by three. Impressive anticipation on the lead pass. Putting it right on the money for his teammate. Outside, Irving. Again, the Cavaliers score. And you know the offense has been flowing all game. Neither side can get a stop. Looks like both coaches want plenty of material for the film room to Here's Woodson. Puts it up from 15. Nice jump shot. Good. Woodson's got four this quarter. And the Cavaliers with possession here. They trail by three. Pass to Jones. And here's Irving. That's in. Coming off an assist from Jones. Jones has got five assists tonight. Excellent distribution. That possession highlighting how important unselfishness is. Here's Drew. Now, here's Lemby. Pass to O'Corn. This ball moved by Boston. Here's Drew. Back to Lambeer, over Walton, and Beer, good. You hear about his physical toughness, but how about the mental toughness by Bill Lambeer to take and make that big shot? Sobers passes to Irving, and it's in after a nice ball drop the right side. Irving's got 44. You can always trust Dr. J to deliver for you in the high-stakes moment. He's always ready to step up. Pass to Woodson. Here's Drew. Here's Woodson. Twenty feet out. The rebound by Walton. Walton's got seven rebounds in the game. Here's Foy. Pass to Irving. That won't go, missing the go-ahead bucket. The Celtics with the lead. Here's O'Corn. High post Lambeer. Here's Drew. Shoots from the elbow. He hits the bad guy and sinks the shot. O'Corn's got nine points now in just the second half. And it's Irving with the ball for the Cleveland Cavaliers. Shot goes down. What a move showing off the handles there. And there's a minute 45 left in the fourth quarter. There's a screen by Collins. Here's Woodson. Pass to O'Coin. Here's Woodson. Four on the shot clock. Drew gets the bucket. And the Celtics lead by three. Ball distribution was there. I mean, outstanding work all the way around. Irving loses the ball. The steal. Here's Woodson. Collins, a screen on Irving. Here's Woodson. Covered by Irving. Here's Lambeer. And he's fouled pretty hard shot, but he's got the chance to pick up the points at the line. It's going to go on Bill Walton. Never afraid of getting physical out there. Lambeer loves going at the defense and earning the foul. Brown is checked in for the Celtics. Here's Floyd. Time out, time out. Cavalier.
Houston. One point lead, the biggest of the game. Timeout, Cavaliers. seconds left in the fourth quarter. Now, here is Irving. He's tightly guarded. Yes, that goes in. The doctor, Julius Irving, is a smooth operator in the clutch. I expect Clark, they'll take their time here. Yeah, every second that ticks away plays to their advantage. Woodson. It's in! Time out. Okay. Seconds separating the shot and game clocks. Again, what an avalanche! Terrific work off the inbound pass. Catching the defense off guard and going right up with the shot. And that's an intentional foul. Increases their lead to six. And he hits both free throws here. So now it's a seven point game. Way to capitalize at the charity stripe and extend the lead. Outside Irving. There's the triple. Knocks down the trifecta. Nothing like setting someone up. Feels better than making a shot. To me, at least. And now an intentional foul. They need the ball back as soon as possible. Hey, that's the right play. It's the smart play. You got to stop the clock. Hoping for a missed free throw or two. Every point is crucial here. Shoot two. He 
gets the first one, and that puts them up by five. unable to get the second one from past the arc on the money and there it is the Boston Celtics come away with a huge win all right that'll be all from us tonight this play in game just a taste of what's to come in the upcoming postseason for Mike Fratello Clark Kellogg and David Aldridge and our entire 2k crew this is Kevin Harlan thanking you for tuning in so long and good night, everyone.